Hello, this is Max Williams with Robinson and Harris Real Estate, and today we're in Chesterfield County. More specifically, we are off the Beach Road corridor, and we're going to take a look at a five bedroom, three and a half bath home. This home is situated here on a nice, partially wooded one and a half acre lot. It's a, a very nice, quiet, tranquil setting. We've got uh, trees that are distributed throughout the first excuse me, throughout the front yard. Uh, we've got a great floor plan. I really, really like this first floor master floor plan. Here to the left, we do have a three car detached garage uh, on the main structure. We're going to have a two car garage. So we've got a lot of additional space for excess personal property. Uh, excess personal property is defined by many people as simply stuff or junk but uh, excess personal property sounds much, much better. We've got a nice front porch here. Great place for a couple rocking chairs. Let's go on in and take a look. We're gonna do something a little different. This home uh, has wonderful wood floors here. This is our formal dining room. The bank that owns this home has actually come through and they have put in new carpet. Uh, we've got a room here at the front that would be perfect as a home office, interesting ceiling fan there. And we've got double doors leading into this room. We're gonna actually start upstairs on this one and then we're gonna work our way down. Uh, we're now in the two-story family room. We've got a little nook there for your audiovisual equipment and gas log fireplace. Let's go on up. We've got nice wood staircase here at the top of the steps. Really nice built-in bookshelf there as well. We're going to start here to our left. This is probably the most conservative of the second floor bedrooms. We've got a small closet there. This is actually more like a linen closet. Uh, this home is actually listed as four bedrooms, but by my account, we've got five. Nice two bowl vanity there and our fiberglass tub shower enclosure. Bedroom number two. This is a really good size room. It's still functional even with those knee walls. Really nice walk-in closet. They put in these partitions, these customized cabinets. That really gives you a lot of storage options in these walk-in closets in particular. Little linen closet there. We're now in bedroom number three. This is probably an average size bedroom. This paint may be not may not be to your liking, but it is definitely in great condition. Uh, out of all of the foreclosures that I typically cover, this one is definitely on the higher end as far as property condition. We've got a walkthrough bathroom here. I'm going to take you through the other direction. Uh, this is our fourth bedroom. Uh, this also is a really good sized bedroom. Got a nice size closet directly ahead as well. Now this bathroom, you can actually walk through and get back to the hallway that we just came in. So that's a really, really neat feature. Uh, the two story family room is just really, really attractive if you like a two, if you like an open floor plan rather. And we're going to pop out here to our screened back porch. Really nice. You can keep the bugs off of you with it being screened in. And if you are the type of person that likes to keep Christmas lights or holiday lights or whatever you like to call them up all year round, they have a neighborhood association here. And I bet you that association doesn't appreciate that type of activity. Okay, we have our informal dining space here. Your dinette would go right there in the middle. We've got tray ceiling and our nice open kitchen. We have a solid surface countertop, also known as Corian, and ceramic tile backsplash. Really good looking cabinetry here. Black appliances do convey. That's a pantry directly ahead and space for your refrigerator with ice maker. All right, we're gonna take, actually, we're gonna go back this direction. 
we've got our powder room right here convenient to the dining area and the kitchen and straight on back we've got our laundry room that door of course goes out to the side of the house your washer and dryer would go right there and please note the interesting attempt there at the at the faux stone finish that uh, they started but didn't quite seem to finish that's a pretty interesting project this way we have our attached two-car garage notice we do have a remote uh, opener there and this home does have central vac we don't see a lot of central vac in homes in this area but central vac is an amazing feature imagine being able to just carry a hose around and connect it to the wall and not have to lug a traditional vacuum cleaner you just plug your hose in right there that's kind of a neat feature look at this this is our first floor master when was the last time you saw a master bedroom with a fireplace there and then your tv would go right above that is a really really neat feature we've got a tray ceiling in this room nice crown molding as well once again there is new carpet throughout this home we're now going into our master bath there you go jetted tub and our shower with the shower head intact and that ceramic tile all the way through they got a little bench there in case you need to take a load off and our walk-in closet once again we've got the compartmental system here in this closet plenty of places there for shoes we've got the cabinets there just really nice layout the gentlemen can put their neckties there on all those little uh hangers just really nice and convenient and of course we've got our double vanity the throne there in the corner and just plenty of space here in this master bath if you or anyone you know is interested in a home i'd be honored to help uh, this home is currently listed at uh, just under 375,000. The county seems to think it's worth uh, about 424,000. And uh, I have a feeling you might be able, able to get it for even a little bit less than the asking price. Max Williams, 402 7788. It can be reached on the web at Richmond House Info. Dot com or on Facebook, Richmond Area Foreclosures. Thanks so much for taking the tour. Have a great day.